If you're creating objects that are symmetrical, then you can save a lot of time and effort by only drawing half of it. That's where the mirror command comes in handy. Open up the mirror examples file. Here we have a profile of a bolt and a profile or half of a profile of a vase. To start the mirror command, you can just type in mirror or you can type in just the two letters MI for the command alias. It's also found here on the modify panel on the ribbon. The mirror command is really quite simple. You select your object or objects that you want to mirror, then press enter. Now you need to pick two points. These points will create an imaginary line that your object will be mirrored on. In the case of this vase, I've drawn a construction line right down the middle of it, and we're going to use that. You don't have to have the line there but I'm showing you this line so that you can visualize it a bit easier. So we've selected our objects, and now we want to mirror it based on the endpoint here of the top of the vase. That's our starting point of our mirror line. Now as I pick the second point, you can see how AutoCAD is literally mirroring the line work. Now we want it to come right down to the bottom. So we're going to snap to that bottom point on the vase. Now once you've mirrored your object, you have the option of deleting the original object or not. In this case, we want to keep it. So we type in the letter N and press Enter. And there we've completed our vase, and we only had to draw half of it. That's quite handy. Now let's undo this and erase that line. And let's try it again. Start the mirror command, select the object, press enter, snap with an end O snap to the top of the vase, and then snap again. Wait, let's do it a little bit differently. Press your F8 button for your ortho command, and that will put it right in orthogonally. As you rotate around, you see that it mirrors about that line, and since the line essentially only goes in one of two places, there are only two options for you. But this keeps everything nice and tidy, nice and horizontal, and nice and straight, and it does it very quickly. Again, don't erase the object, and now we have a nice vase for our drawing. Now let's mirror something again, this bolt. Select the object, and you can pick it. You can use a crossing window, you can use a selection window, all of our selection tools are available to us. Press enter, pick a point, and pick another point. Now this time, let's erase the object. Type in the letter Y for yes, press enter. So now we've gotten rid of our bolt, and we've turned it around all at the same time. 